Hey, how's it going? Welcome back to some Ark Valgero. Gonna go ahead and do a little bit of work on our base today. And then I also want to go out and try to get us... I don't know, maybe an Argentavis. I saw some over there. Been doing a little bit of scouting, looking around. Got a little bit of resources for us and trying to figure out what I want to do with the base here. So in here, I've got some foundations, a little bit of double door frames, a gate, and then a door. That's going to be used for making our trap for the Argentavis. I need to make some ceilings. Let's try to get that started. I've got a couple. I've got four. I need to make two more. Hey, how's it going, Jimmy? Croc, everybody doing all right today? So let's get two more of these made, and that should be enough. There we go. Ah, not too bad, not too bad. How's it going, Tommy? Alright, so that should be good for what we need for the trap. I'm hoping everybody will be fine over here when we're gone. We're going to be taking with us... We're going to be going on the Pterodon. We'll be taking the Feather Raptor with us. And then all these guys are going to stay here. Let's put them on neutral, just in case. Just whistle everybody neutral. Hey, how's it going, Will? Oh, how'd that Void Worm team go? It's it's kind of tough, isn't it? Ah, oh, 180 female. I think that's max level for those, right? How's it going, boy boy? Let's leave all that junk here. I think that'll be alright. So what we need to do is grab a little bit of stuff for narcotics. We'll go back to the old base. We'll make up some... I think I need to get some spoiled meat from there. We'll make up some tranks, and then we'll head over and start our taming. I need to grab our bow and arrow, and I think I got some arrows over there, too. That was a wrong button. Oh, uh, you gonna try breeding them? Ah, uh, 190. Yeah, I knew it was something like that. I think that's the same as with the rock drakes, right? See, let's get rid of everything except for those. He's got a bunch of levels. We'll put the levels into him in a minute. I just want to get some of these and head over and start getting the narcotics made up. Hey, how's it going, Hunter? Yeah, so for the people just joining in, today we're going to be working on a small Argentavis trap. There's some Ar Argentavis right over there. There's a 145 I saw. So we'll try to tame it, use it for our hauler, and then we're going to be working on the base today. So we also need to go down into the aberration area to grab some crystal. It's kind of one point of using the Argentavis too, so we can use him for bringing stuff back. We'll use the horse to go down in and get it and then bring it out. Yeah, I'm hoping to get a good... Good part of the base done today, if we can. Resources, depending, you know. See, that might be enough for enough of the tranks. Let's put that all into weight. How's it going, Candy? I will head over here. I guess I could take... Well, I don't know. I don't know how the horse would work trying to knock out an Argentavis. I mean... <laughs> We got quite a few of the narcotics and stuff. We'll just make up some darts. Because I don't think he'll be able to reach your Argentavis in my trap. So I'm thinking for the base. I'm not sure what to do out on this side. But on the far side where those two trees are, I think we're going to kind of make it like a terrace where it drops down. And then we'll put... Kind of like our deck out there, and put the industrial cooker and all that good stuff out on the the outside over here. So this, of course, will expand this way once I figure out what we want to do. But right here, that's just a temporary stair. We'll drop it down to maybe about this height. And then all this will kind of put some triangle of the ceilings out and make this round. And then this will be kind of like a little deck out here for all of our cooking stuff, kibble making, all that. 
Let's grab our berries and head over to our other base. Or actually, I just need to go over there to get our meat and stuff, because we're using him for the mortar and pestle. So let's leave that in there. Let's jump on the pterodon real quick and go grab that stuff. How are we on weight? Ah, oh, man, we are pretty full on weight. That's fine. We should still be just about regular speed on this. Yeah, I was out on the horse trying to get a bunch of wood and stuff before we started the stream. And, oh, dude, the amount of aloes that are on that side over there. Yeah, that's a crazy amount of them. It's one of the ones that killed our, uh, our Jaboa in the last one. Things are no joke, man. So I ended up putting points into weight on the Pterodon. Otherwise, he wouldn't be able to make it with all the stuff for the trap. Kind of sucks. I was wanting to put everything into speed and health so we can use him to grab some wyvern eggs coming up here soon. But, I mean, it'll be fine. It is what it is. Oh, we're out of stamina. I wasn't watching it. I'm used to having a lot more. <laughs> Hopefully those raptors aren't over here that's usually around. Usually one of those tech raptors around. Right in this area. Ah, right, that should be good. Our base is just right up over this cliff here. So grab the bow, the spoiled meat, and then... I need to either make some arrows or grab the ones that we have. I don't know. I don't know if I have very many made up. Oh, I forgot our base got kind of destroyed from that... Ah, oh, those those trikes that were over here. Totally forgot about that. Oh, man, there's all of our stuff. Well, we got spoiled meat. <laughs> Dude, they destroyed everything over here. Well, I'm glad we were done with this for hatching eggs. Ah, the Argigas. Yeah, man, it took me forever to be able to actually find one. And I found both of them kind of on, well, one was in the destroyed side, like on the left ring, and the other one was in the right ring. But once I found them, it's like I kept seeing them all over the place then. All right, I think we're good in here for all this stuff for right now. We don't need to take any of it with us. Maybe like the, the light stuff. All this meat I'm going to have to leave because I can't carry it with the, the weight on the bird. And we'll grab some of that. We need to make a bed over there. All right, so let's just leave the meat here. It'll spoil, so that'll kind of work out. Cool, and that should be good. Oh, he destroyed our preserving bin. Ah, oh, man. That's all right. We'll just leave all that for right now. There's some berries. We'll take them. Now, right, let's see how heavy the bird's going to be. He might not be able to get off the ground. Yep. Ah, dude, I'm trying to take too much. Yeah, we're way overweight. We don't need all that spoiled meat for right now. We'll just take... We'll take 100 with us. That should be fine. And then we don't need all this cooked meat. We can always make some more over there. Probably the berries we could leave too. How much do we weigh now? We should be fine. Right? Get off the ground, buddy. Ah, oh, man. Still too heavy, huh? So the Dino Wipe, do you have it enabled so that you can do console commands and stuff? Are you on PC? Alright, that's alright. Thanks for stopping by, Candy. Man, we're going to have to leave some of this stuff. I'll have to come back for it. These are the thing that weighs the most. We'll come back for these. Don't know why I'm closing the door. There's like a big old hole in the side of the building. We got everything we needed though, right? Arrows, stuff to make tranks. 
Yeah, we're good. Yeah, you got to be able to do the admin commands to be able to do a dino wipe. All right, Candy, sounds good. Oh, you can do admin commands. You can or can't? If you can, then when you go to put that in, all you have to do is spell out uh, destroy wild dinos. All one word, but it has to be capital letters for the beginning of the three words, if that makes sense. So, like, destroy would have a capital D, and then wild would have the capital W, and then dinos would have the capital D, but it needs to be all one word. And it'll wipe everything off, and then sometimes it takes a couple seconds, sometimes it takes a minute or so. Best thing to do after you do that is try to fly around the map so stuff will start respawning. Alright, so let's get some of these narcotics made up. It's gonna be 87. That should be plenty to do in Argentavis. And then we just need to make a bow. I think we have everything. You got nothing in you. We'll go ahead and we'll make two of them. Just so we have a backup. I think it's only like 50 arrows you can use anyways on each one. Yep, that's, that looks about right. Hit enter, and then it'll do its thing. The best thing to do is do that, like, in front of a dino, so that way you can see when it disappears. It'll just disappear right in front of your eyes whenever it works. Alright, so we're good there. Let's build a bed real quick. Yep, no problem, man. And we'll just put it right here. I'm kind of setting everything just kind of in the middle until we get everything else set up. And we'll leave all this junk here. Alright, are you done making those yet? I know you're a little slow on making stuff. Alright, I'll tell you what, while he's making up the rest of that, let's head over and grab the rest of the stuff that we couldn't bring over in the Pterodon. We'll leave these here, just to make sure we got enough space. Could leave all those arrows here, too. Alright. One last trip over there, hopefully he'll have the narcotics done, and then we can go over and start setting up our trap for the Argentavis. Dude, there's quite a few wrecks around here, too. There's one here, and then there's like three of them back over that way. So that'll be nice when we go decide to tame one of those. There's plenty of them around. I'll tell you what, Adela better leave us alone. We've had so many problems with those things. Yep, yep. Ah, I knew it. I'll tell you what, those things are so annoying. Almost worse than the Pegos are. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Nothing's worse than a Pego. Um, I don't know yet. It'll be kind of like our main base for a little bit. I do want to build... I like building them all over the place. I want to put one down in the Aberration area if we're going to be down there a lot. And then possibly we'll be building one up around where the Wyvern Trench is. I like to have one there for respawning and then... Just kind of like keep us safe when we're doing stuff up there. Because that's where we'll also be doing like the... There's a Giga Team up there, and then the Rock Elemental. So all that stuff's kind of in that area, so... There'll probably be another little cottage up that way. Alright, so that's that. I think we'll be good. So the good news is, since it is nighttime, it'll be probably day as soon as we go to start doing our team on the Argentavis. A little bit of water. Should get a water jar here made pretty soon too, once we get some more crystal. How's it going, mix up? 
Yeah, see, there's that raptor I was worried about when we stopped to get stamina a few minutes ago. That dude is all over down here. Hopefully, all of our narcotics are ready. It's the only thing about the horse versus a mortar and pestle. It seems like it goes so much slower when he's making stuff. A little bit of stamina here before we run out over there by the other aloes. Does I say that there's a Rex right over there? Should be good enough. We're almost back to base. I do like how bright it is over here in the Chalk Hills at night, though. Oh, man. So much easier to see. Unless I must built over there near the Redwoods. Ah, oh, dude, it got, like, so dark at night. Hey, how's it going, Mr. Rowell? Rowell? Glad you like the videos. All right, so we're good there. Let's go ahead and grab the rest of this. Oh, he's still making it up. Dude, he crafts that so slow. All right, so we got, what, 14 and 18. We're getting there, we're getting there. Let's grab the rest of this stuff out of here. Start getting our pterodon ready. All right, so that's all that. All we're waiting on, man, is you. Get the rest of these narcotics made up. Tell you what, let's go ahead and grab him and go get some metal. I don't know if there's any metal around here. We could go do some drops while we're waiting. Let's go do drops. We'll take the little feather raptor out. Try to get over there and get those drops before they go away. How are we on weight? We're well, not too bad. I'd like to get that red one. See what's in it. Yeah, these are the aloes. Let's get rid of them real quick. Uh-huh. Not dealing with these guys anymore. Still a little bit salty about how they killed us. Just saying. It was pretty rude. That should be good. Tell you, man, if this guy had a little bit longer wings, uh, it'd be so nice. It'd be nice if he was more of a glider, you know? Kind of like the Rock Drake is. Alright, what you got? Nothing we want. Nah, I was thinking about keeping that. It's all junk. Wasn't there a blue one over here? Thought there was. Hold on to that, drop the rest. Where'd he go? Dude, where'd my rod go? Oh, what are you doing, man? Playing peekaboo? <laughs> oh, I thought he left me. I thought I saw that raptor over here kind of started getting worried. Oh, they killed that one Rex that was over here. It's him laying on the ground right there. Ah, oh, it's a 150. No wonder it killed him. Watch out, he doesn't kill us. Yep, yep, yep. I don't need two of you swinging at me. Be good levels, though. Oh, dude, we're not doing too good. Yep, 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 yep. Dude, we lost a lot of health on that one. Alright, let's start heading back and 
see if our stuff's ready. I really want to get that Argentavis team. He's kind of like the one thing that's holding us up for building because we're going to need a lot of that crystal. Yeah, those void worms, man, they're no joke. Especially whenever you get a bunch of them after you. I didn't realize that it dismounts you whenever that electricity hits you. Is that another raptor? It is. It's a bunch of them. I need to get a big gate set up, too. Oh, I got in it. I was trying to go around that cloud. All right. Yep, yep, yep. Let's get out of that. Yeah, it's kind of hard to pick them off when there's a whole group of those, especially being in space, you know. You can drag them out into the world, kind of trap them to get them out of the way, but... Yeah, it's a bit of a pain. All right, how you doing? Still working on it. Well, I tell you what. Would you go somewhere, please? Thank you. Appreciate it. I don't know. This might be enough. I think we'll go with this. It'll be good. Let's get this guy healed up. We're going to throw him in a cryopod, take him with us. So we're going to be using the Pterodon as bait whenever we get over there. We'll build the trap. He should be able to fit through the double doorways. Get the Argentavis in. Close the door. Hey, how's it going, Jurassic Bandit? Glad you like the videos. There's quite a bit of them there. <laughs> quite a few playthroughs on Ark. But yeah, we'll, uh, we'll use the Pterodon as bait for the Argentavis, and then we'll keep this guy around just for a little bit of protection. There is some aloes and Rex over that way, so I'd rather not die if possible today. That would be fantastic. I think that's good enough on him. Let's keep that. We'll drop the rest. We'll throw this into... We'll just throw it into the horse. Cool. All right, I think we're ready. Let's go ahead and crop on this guy and start heading over. And a good thing is it's really close to base, so if I did forget something, it's just flying across the river to come back. Dude, why are you so overweight? Is it all the... It's all the arrows, man. Ah, uh, dude. Okay, well, let's give this to you. And then... Give those to you. Yep, that'd be alright. That's, that's fast enough. Like I said, we're not going too far. My favorite team? My favorite team is uh, Thyla. That's like the best all around. And then for flying, it's got to be the Griffin. I do like Sabres, though. Sabres are like a close second to the Thyla. If you could get a Saber to climb up walls like the Thyla, uh, it'd for sure be a, a Saber then. Yeah, that's the thing about art. If you leave it alone for a while, as soon as you start playing it, oh man, all your time goes, <laughs> it goes away fast. We'll stop and get some stamina here. And we're going just right over that ridge there. This dude is way down. Oh my gosh. Alright, buddy. Just make it across the water. We'll be alright. I think the cave is like right there too that goes underwater for the underwater area. I'll have to check that out soon too once we get a good water tame. Oh, does it get reduced weight on everything? Dude, I didn't know that if it does. I got a monkey over on the island playthrough that we're doing currently. Oh, 
Oh yeah, cement paste. We should be able to get quite a bit of that from right here for our glass windows. Oh, 45 with the bow. So I've got what? 80, so that, you know, that'll account for how much I usually miss. So we should be good then. And we're doing a 145, I think, is the one I saw over here. So that should that should work out fairly well. Alright, so let's go on top of this little mountain here. We'll start building our trap. And then the Argentavis is just on the other side over here. So it's not too far to kite him. Yeah, we'll start building it right here. Perfect timing. He is out of stamina. Let's clear a little bit of space. We're only doing a uh, two by three, so we don't need too much room. I just want to be able to see, though. All right, let's start it. Ah, oh, man, it's kind of uneven here. Pretty bad. Really big slope. I'm hoping that's going to be long enough. I can't remember how long I usually do them. It's been a while since I've used traps for taming since we got that net launcher with the Genesis 2 update. Hey, how's it going, Croc? It has a 3% chance, or I do. Because usually it's me that ends up dying, not the tame. <laughs> Well, I mean, other than the Pterodons we tried in the last video. That was, yeah, that was, this is like number three that we had to tame on them. So it's a very simple trap. The double doorways allow the Pterodon to fit through, but not the Argentavis. I think I made too many of these. Or do we want to go all the way up? I made enough to go all the way up. Uh, let's go all the way up. That'll work. Wait, where's the rest of my... Dude, where's the rest of my ceilings? Well, guess we'll make four more real quick. Let's grab some stuff. Not exactly sure what happened to them. I think I might have left them in the horse. Yeah, I tell you what, yep. Hopefully there's not too much of that saying today. <laughs> that would be fantastic. Alright, let's grab a little bit of wood. Watch out for the raptors over here. I think there's micro raptors down here on the ground too, isn't there? There's some bugs. Yep, micro raptors. Yep, 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 yep. We're not going right there. It's the last thing I need in my life right now. Dude, they're all over the place. We good? We all right for a second. As I say that one's trying to walk over to us. Ah, don't do it. We're overweight. Drop some stuff. Oh, I knew it. Well, I tell you what. Hmm. Well, it's going to be interesting. You just wait. Uh huh. You get off the ground now, thank you. Glad you waited till I almost died there. Alright, so where's the other two at? Did I drop something I needed? I did, I think I dropped the thatch I was using.
Yep, that sounds big. Um, we got a second. You just hang tight, buddy. I need a little bit of thatch, and you can have your trees back. Well, he tried to, he tried to bite us. You see that? Oh, defense foundations. Yeah, I like doing stuff a little bit different sometimes. I usually build a trap like this on the back of a parasaur. That way you can just have like a little mo mobile taming trap going with you. That's kind of nice. It works out. All right, so that's all we need. Let's get rid of all this extra junk. Ah, uh, we'll keep the metal. We'll be using that here soon. Actually, let's give him a little bit. Dude's getting hungry, man. I didn't feed him breakfast today. All right, cool. Let's find our Argentavis. So he was right over here when I was scouting. I think that's him right there. Dude, your head's in the way. Yep, that's it. Cool. Let's get a little bit of aggro. Here we go. Wait, just one of you, please. Oh, man, I just want one of you. Well, I guess we'll have them both in the trap. Nope. There we go. Let's let this one bite us so it'll stay up with us. I think that's the one we want. Ah, oh, they're both coming still. Yep, that's the one. Cool. Ah, oh, man, I was trying to get far enough away so that one would lose aggro, but would keep it on this other one. Hey! Alright, let him nip us a little bit. There we go. Come on, buddy, you're almost there. Get our altitude down a little bit. Nice, nice. No Houdini tricks and flying out, please. I've had that happen before. Yep, just like that. Don't go anywhere. You'll be all right. Take a nap. Easy, buddy. As long as those wrecks stay down below, that's what I'm kind of worried about is that wrecks four-wheel driving up over that thing. Oh, yeah, that's where we're at now is the island. I got the dragon left, and then we'll be starting on... The tech cave. Kind of nervous about it a little bit, not gonna lie. What teams did you use on the Broodmother? Come on, dude, don't die, man. Just pass out here in a minute. Why are we falling down the mountain here? After Genesis 2? I don't know. Have you done any of the other maps? I say Aberration. That's always a good one to go to. It's kind of hard to get your your base start and stuff, but once you do, it's a, it's a pretty cool map. Either that or Crystal Isles. Ah, dude, I hope we don't kill this guy. He looks like really bad shape right now. Yeah, Valgaro's a good one, too. Ooh, Extinction. Oh, man, that's a, that's a rough map there. It's good if you like tech stuff. Oh, man, is it good if you like tech. I think we might lose this. Oh, is he down? Oh, he's flying away. Come here, dude. Take a nap. 
before you die. I'd like to get a headshot, but he's moving around too much. I don't think it really matters. I can't believe he's not down yet, really. Yeah, I was thinking about doing the center instead of this map for the playthrough. We might go there next, after we leave this map. I've never done a full playthrough on... Oh, there he goes. On the center. I've only done it a little bit. Alright, buddy. How's your health looking? Oh my gosh, he almost died. Well, let's, um... Get this dude out. Throw him in the crowd pod. We'll go get some prime meat. There's that Rex down there. We'll take him out, grab some prime meat, come back up, a couple pieces, and we will have us in Argentavis. Supposedly. Hopefully. That's the plan. It's not guaranteed to work, but... Alright, you're on neutral. That's what I wanted with all those micro raptors down here. Let's put your point into damage. Come on, buddy. We're on like a... Time constraint here. Where'd that Rex go, man? He couldn't have gone too far. Oh, there he is. Oh, there's two of them. Fantastic. Uh-huh. Remember when I was, I was trying to get a little bit of thatch and he came roaring at me? Just saying. It's pretty rude. Yeah, that was pretty close to dying. Cool. So we're good there on stuff for taming. Yeah, a couple more hits with those arrows. I don't know if headshots matter on the Argentavis or not. Alright, let's make sure we're good here. I think we are. I don't want you running off. Stay there. That's more, way more food than we need, but I always like to overdo it. Wait. Give me those back. And that. I thought the ARC mobile looked pretty cool. It's definitely not what all I thought it looked like. It looks a lot better. It's kind of weird how they named the bushes and everything. Oh yeah, I forgot about the taming tracker. Where is it at? Right here. I always forget about it because I'm not used to using it. And I didn't hit the button. There we go. So he's got 27% off the one piece of prime meat. So a couple pieces and he will be good. Let's take a look, look around while he's doing that. I don't think there's too much over here. There's some sabers usually I'm kind of interested in. Since we're talking about cats and stuff. Oh, dude, the Stegos got us. Let me go. Yep, we're in a bad spot. Keep forgetting he's so squishy. It's like a three-way battle here. Yep, we're getting in. We're getting out of here. Oh, we're getting out of here. We're out of stamina. Let's get our stamina back. Oh, dude, yep. I need to start messing around until I get a little bit better stamina on this guy. Yeah, I saw that glitch you were talking about on Genesis 2 also, Croc. With down in Rockwell's area, how it's messing up. I think we're going to heal back up. What is that, a Carno? Come on, dude. Heal back up, we'll go smack that Rex around a little bit. Oh, it was a 140? Kind of explains why we almost died then, I guess. <laughs> oh, dude's in bad shape, man. I 
need to make us an Argentavis saddle. A little bit more of the chitin, our keratin, and then hide. We got everything else. Let's heal up a little bit. We'll go kill some stuff, and we'll take the Argentavis on the way back and pick up our Feather Raptor and just carry it. I want to take that Rex out, though. Be some really good points for our team. Hey, how's it going? Nice to see you made it to the stream. I think that'll be good enough. We should be all right. Where did he go running off to? There he is. Let's get our stamina back since we have a issue with stamina. He's a little preoccupied as well anyways. Yep, there you go. Waste your time roaring. Ain't gonna help you. Guy to tell you, didn't want to listen. How many points did we get off of that? Two points. That's not too bad. Checking our bird up here. See how he's doing. He should be just about ready. What's up, bud? He's still taking a nap, huh? You doing good on food? You are. All right, let's grab us a little bit of keratin or chitin. We'll get him in that saddle made. We might as well stop by down here to the beavers and grab some paste while we're here so they can start producing more. Gonna need a lot for the build coming up here in a few minutes. That should be good for now. Need to find some trikes or something. Dota could work too. I really wish we would have had that second one as a pack bonus that we ended up killing. When I become famous, uh, we're... <laughs> I don't think that'll ever happen. I just play video games, man, and post it on YouTube. <laughs> so we got 32, I think we needed 150. Alright, let's take a look and try to find a little bit more. Maybe we'll get it right about the same time as he wakes up. There's a lot going on down here, though. Is that two more wrecks? There's a lot of wrecks on this map. Excuse me. Let me jump into this little battle here. There we go. Thank you. Appreciate your donations. T-Rex removal service. Dude, this is not a friendly neighborhood. Keep the arrows. Oh, the micro raptors! I tell you what, if I get knocked off around the wrecks, that would <laughs> be horrible. All right. Oh, you know what? There's scorpions over here. We can get a bunch of our chitin that we need from them. Right on the other side over here. Let's put this point into a little bit more damage. Yeah, I do have plans to do a cluster series. As soon as we're done with. Who are you yelling at, man? Talking over here. As soon as we're done with the island and we start our modded play uh, playthrough, I plan on kind of doing all my maps as like a cluster. So that will be a thing. I just haven't decided yet if I want to fully wipe the maps. Because I got bases still on all of them, right? So I think I might wipe them and just start all new on each map as modded. I'm not sure yet. That's the only part I'm still trying to figure out. So, those have a lot of keratin, but, yep, that'd be a bad day. Kind of weird. Oh, there's a scorpion there. A couple of those and we should be good. I mean, there's 60 there. I think we only need 150. All right, let's see. We might have enough. Yep, I see it coming. Trying to sneak up on me. I see how it is. Just some hide, which we have plenty of. There we go. One set. I'll make it up. And our Argentavis is ready. Let's 
get up there before something happens to him. We'll get rid of this this beaver dam as well. They're still kind of kind of angry at us, but we'll destroy it. They'll build another one. I don't. I play all my stuff on single player. I don't do any server stuff. Well, they are not happy at all, are they? Let's get you guys over here. I just want your paste. There's always one lagging behind, isn't it? Oh, dude! Yep, yep, yep. Took too long. <laughs> it's alright, we're done. We're good here. We've got a little bit to start off with. Yeah, I know. That's why I'm trying to get back. Dude, don't even bring up the, the Dillos, man. Oh, those things have been such a pain. The past couple days taming stuff. Thought we needed water, but we didn't. Poor little beavers destroyed their little homes, man. It's all right. They'll build another one. It'll keep them busy. Full-time employment. What are we way down from? Let's drop that little bit of metal. We don't need it. We don't need that. Oh, that saddle. I think weighs a lot, man. Well, we're kind of getting set up fairly quick. Oh, there's a drop coming down, too. Fantastic. Yeah, I've had a lot of people ask about setting up a server. I'll do it one day whenever I have more time to actually do stuff with it. I'm just so short on time right now, it's kind of hard to do too much, you know? I don't want to be one of those people that sets it up and then never joins it or does anything. Alright, so. How's it going, buddy? Dude. The tail. So, tamed out to be a level 217. 2,900 on the health. Stamina is 1,000. Weight is 688. Damage is almost 400%. This is going to go all mainly into that. I'll tell you what, let's repair this. While we're here. And our feet that are almost broken. So, I want to go back... What do you want to do first? Do you want to go down into the aberration area and grab some crystal, or should we go back and start building on the base first? I mean, we need both of those done, but which do you guys want to do first? Um, the only thing I'm kind of worried about playing on other servers is it have to be people that do recordings and stuff, because I don't want to start like a series and do recordings and then have like the base get totally wiped and stuff like that, you know? That's the main reason I don't do any recordings on servers. That kind of messes up your whole schedule, you know, if you got your stuff set up and you're logging in after a couple days to uh, to record and then you're like totally wiped or something. Check this drop. Now, what do you guys think? Should we head down and grab some crystal, or should we just start building some? We're gonna need... We're gonna need crystal eventually, though, to do all of our windows. Thanks, and glad you're enjoying them. It's always nice to hear when people enjoy the videos. Let's grab some wood on the way back. It's the main thing I'm kind of missing. The Dodic is doing fantastic at getting all the stone we need. It's just, dude, getting wood right now. If we had a chainsaw, oh, it would be, be a lot easier. I guess we could go rob the rest of the beavers for wood. That's a quick source of it. See, I'm having problems on this map with folders. I can't put anything into them like I usually do. It's shown in both places, so I don't know. It's kind of... It's kind of weird. It's only on Valgaro. Yeah, that's the thing. I'm not too much into PvP at all in most games. Um, 
And with Ark, I don't know, it's like a huge, huge grind, and, you know, a lot of stuff goes on with the PvP, or, yeah, the PvP and Ark, so I tend to just stay away from it. Too much drama a lot of the times. Alright, let's head back over here. Since our base is right across the water here. Oh yeah, it's interesting, alright. <laughs> it's interesting to watch other people do it. Yeah, yeah, that's a problem with PvP on a lot of servers. Again, that's why I usually don't do it too much because, or I don't do it at all because I just, yeah. It's too hard to record and stuff. If I was playing by myself and not doing recordings, it'd probably be a little bit different. Dude, there's Rex even down here on the beach. Ah, oh, dude, official PvP? Yeah, that's a horrible grind there. Just to have it all get wiped. Yep, 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 gotta love stealing wyvern eggs, man. Oh, dude. You're like, look around, none will be there, you'll pick up the egg, and then all of a sudden, auto-magically, there's like 20 of them coming after you. Kinda like those aloes down there. I don't know how many I've killed off recently, and they are all over the place. Ah, uh, we got a raptor up here. Well, let's build just a little bit on the base until we're out of stone and wood, and then we'll head down into the aberration area, grab crystal. We're gonna need to grab some metal and start smelting too. Did that raptor drop down? I think he did. Ah, oh, he's right here. Uh-huh. Pick on someone that can fight back, just saying. Let's put this into weights. I mean, his weight's doing all right. It's not bad at all. That's another point there too. All right, so we're gonna need to make some, some more building materials up. Let's start on, let's bring this out a couple more, maybe two more ceilings worth, and then we'll build this part on, because I know what I wanna do there, and that'll kinda give us time to figure out what we wanna do up here. So these would be stone walls right here. These are gonna be all glass along the front, and then probably stone over here. I'm not sure if I wanna widen this out a little bit. I was kinda thinking about it. The roof is gonna be flat. Gonna use it for our landing platform, for like wyverns and the birds. Tell you what, can I bring the dodic up there? I don't know if he can roll up that... ...stairs? Yeah, there we go. Alright. We're gonna need pillars and ceilings. I know we got a couple of each. And let's leave those into there. Let's make 20 more of those, and then we'll do ceilings with the rest. I think we're just missing stone now. And maybe we'll get a couple walls. That way we can kind of start getting the framework laid out and figure out what we want to do. Three. A whole three. <laughs> yeah, I'd like to get a wyvern here pretty soon. Maybe within the next couple series. I don't know if we'll use a pterodon. I'll probably tame a moth just because, I don't know, it's really easy to change direction on a moth. I know a lot of people don't like using them, but they work out fairly well. Yeah, that's the other thing, the thing about single player is adjusting the settings. I know I got a lot of mine changed up. A lot of people ask what they are. That's why I post my videos every now and then that shows what my settings are. It just makes it a little bit less of a grind, you know? Yeah, I wish there was griffins on more maps. I mean, it's only on, what, two maps right now? Officially? Without using mods? You got, like, Ragnarok, and then... Actually, that's the only one it's on, right? Just Ragnarok? Alright, we're almost done crafting here. Let's get rid of all this extra weights. Alright, so for sure... 
That's going to be stone. And I'm not sure if I want to do stone here yet, or maybe we'll do... Yeah, let's do stone. Those are going to be all windows. This right here will be a doorway. Double door. Dude, if you push me off, quit messing around. Ah, oh, nice. I wasn't sure if that was going to reach. Alright, so that'll be good for there. Let's get a couple more of these out. Wait, what did I do different? Oh, it's because I doubled up here. I mean, that's fine. It'll be alright. It's not a big deal. And then the ceilings. Dude, please go somewhere. Thank you. Appreciate the cooperation. <laughs> Dude, act like they own this place. I'm just saying. I do like the artifact caves. I wish they had more maps that had them. It's like, by the time they got to, like, Genesis and stuff, they just totally did away with them. I mean, I had some problems in the ones on the island. Oh my gosh, have I had problems in the ones on the island. Today's video and tomorrow's video are nothing but issues. Yeah, and it's a deep cave, too, on Aberration. Oh my gosh. It's like three levels. I mean, there is a surface. You, hopefully you like heat when you're up there, though. Uh, I don't think I've done that one yet. I just got done doing uh, Artifact of the Sky Lord I recorded today for tomorrow. Yep, yep, yep. Go down in the red zone. There's a couple areas you can be down there and not take radiation damage, but dude, for the most part, yep, if you're down there, you're going to have a bad time without a radiation suit. Or the leeches. You can also use leeches. I got a couple of videos up of that. I had to make a poor man's radiation suit. Works fairly well. Well, lamp rays, not re leeches. Kind of the same thing. Alright, we're going to leave that open. And then right here. So let's start on this. So we'll put that one there. I want to come over. I think that's going to be hanging over too far. It's not going to be up that high. I'm just trying to make it to where it's going to be lining up just right. Oh, dude, yeah, I need to go over. I think I need to go over one more. Let's leave that one for the moment. Nope, I think we'll be fine. That'll be alright. That'll be just perfect. Cool. So let's set that one... there. Pick up these if we can. We can't. Wait too long. Alright, so... We want it to where it's gonna be... So this will come down here. I might need to drop down two levels. One set of stairs, two set of stairs. Let's drop this down. How much more are we going to need? Let's get rid of some of this stuff. Dude, the crabs on that map, I totally forgot about those things. They are no joke. Especially how they pick you up off your team if you're using something little. Alright, get rid of that for the moment. Sorry, it takes me a minute to get stuff set up. I think that'll be fine. Let's 
pick this one up as well. We're going to leave those for support. Let's get rid of this, because we're going to be setting stuff on top. Ah, you can't quit Aberration, man. That's like... It's like one of the best maps when you're not dying. <laughs> I mean, that's that's a thing, though, right? It's good to change in between those two, though. I do like both of these. Alright, we'll set all those there. That should be enough. Let's pick these up. And we need to leave that one, right? One, two, one, two. Nope, we can get rid of this one. Oh, we had to demolish. I would have left it if I knew it was going to do that. Alright, let's get some more ceilings made. I need to get some more thatch here soon. Oh, we got some. Nine, we're going to need a lot more than that. Oh, just stone. That's fine. Where do you guys build at on Valgaro for your playthroughs? Yeah, those giant crabs come for the money, all right. They come for everything. Clean you out. But, they are pretty good teams. Dude, those things can jump so far. As long as you build a decent trap, I, I find it easier to tame them up in the green zone. Just because it's it's a lot simpler up there. Chalk hills? Yeah. Chalk hills is pretty nice. It's the first time I've ever built over here. I usually build over there on the three islands. The ones that are in the middle of the map there, around 55, 40. Just because nothing spawns on there, really, that's going to kill you. All right, we'll let these last two craft up. All right, let's see if we can get this worked out now. Don't be smacking your tail at me. What's wrong with you, man? Calm down, dude. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Relax. I know, it's because I put wood in there, right? I'm sorry. I, I apologize. Let's calm down. Put it in the cabinet. Dude, I tell you what, he gets so grumpy. All right, so we'll do that there. And that'll be for our drop down and drops down again. I mean, that's not much of a drop. I mean, it's a little bit. It's fine. It's kind of... Kind of what I was going for. A couple lo lower levels. And actually, do we want to get rid of this one? I do. I wanted to drop down closer. I almost fell off there. Holy crap. I need to put some railings up. What if... So one, two. That'd be good. We can get rid of these. I don't have anything on me. Let's make some stairs, too, so I can kind of see what we're doing. What are we missing? Fiber and wood. Oh, I'll tell you what. Uh, it's not unofficial. This is on a single player. Yeah, the center's got a ton of leads on it, man. I do like the I do like building in the redwoods. Hey, how's it going, dinosaur? That's all good, man. We just went and got us an Argentavis. Built a trap over there. Got one tamed up. It was a 145. I forget what it tamed out to be. And then we're just doing a little bit of work on the base here. And then we need to go down when I run out of stone and stuff. And we'll grab some crystal. Because we're going to be needing quite a bit of it for making our windows. I mean, we're not going to finish everything today. But I want to get a good bit of it done, you know? But the part we're building on now is going to be for our little deck outside. I'm going to put just some railings up. We'll put some little corner pieces here. And then this will be where we'll put the industrial cooker. Stuff like that. So let's get some corners made. A couple railings. Dude, are we out of wood? The RG stats? 
So it's health is almost 3,000. Stamina is 1,000. Weight we've got up to 8. Well, weight's up at 952. And damage is right at 400%. So it's not too bad. I think I'm going to put some points into movement speed since I have that turned on. Let's build some of these real quick before I end up falling off the edge. It's going to happen. I know it's going to happen. Let's do some of the corner pieces here. Is that the regular corner? Yeah. Let's do... I think six will be fine. Ah, glad you like the bases. Dude, it's like every time I go in, it's kind of cool because you're starting over. But then I'm nervous because it's like I'm starting over, right? Have no idea what it's going to turn into. Yeah, the damage is pretty good on it. I was surprised. I usually get them a lot lower than what that is. Ah, this isn't going to look... As well as I thought. Ah, oh, man, I thought the corner piece would fully cover that. Hmm. Well. Let's try something here. I wanted to clip to the other part. Not out there, man, right here. I wanted to clip there and clip through. But it doesn't want to because that one's there. Hmm. The other option is we can clip this one as a ghost one. And then put... A ceiling to that. I don't have any ceilings. Let's pick it up for the moment. We'll mess with that in a minute. We'll have to get that figured out. It's going to take a few minutes. There we go. I feel a little bit safer. Actually, what are you doing like that? Let's put you straight. There we go. That'll work. Four thirty for like the base team. You mean? So we need one, two, three, four. Five more. That is empty. I need to stop looking in it. So yeah, that's the other thing about doing live streams versus recording. Normally for recording, I would pause it right now. <laughs> until I figure out how to do this corner. And then I would start up again. But, since we're not doing a recording. Yeah, I mean, that that would probably be alright like that. It's going to bug me though. I want this triangle to clip to that side. So it'll barely overhang with this one. I just can't get it to clip there. I might have to get rid of that one first. See, I wanted to go like that. Because then they would be barely sticking out of each side. We'll just do that for now. Am I out of railings? Listen, some more wood. I don't want that, dude. I appreciate the present and the thought, but it's not what we're here for. Let's make 10 more of those. We are almost out of stuff. But then we'll do it. Let's do another wall, too. Let's get one of those made up before we run out of stuff. We can make two of them. We'll put our two walls here. We'll leave all that empty. Not going to put anything down there. And then we'll do double doorway there. Or actually, we might just leave that open. We'll put a dino gate. That's what we'll do. We'll do a dino gate as the frame. Let's get a couple railings up so nobody falls. So the other option with this corner is... We could demolish this. Go out one more. And that would kind of solve the issue as well, right? So 
So we can do it like that. And bring it across. Yeah, there we go. Okay, cool. I like that. That's not too bad. Uh, I play on Steam version. Almost all of my games are on Steam. Windows is hard, so I do backup saves of everything that I do. And it's extremely hard with Windows version of stuff to do backups. Because they try to lock everything in. From like having you being able to edit it and whatever. We'll do some railings here. Hmm, I'll have to put down another false ceiling in there so that we can put a railing across right here and have that reach. Yeah, we'll do two of these. Okay, cool. That's not too bad then. Let's do... A couple more of the triangles. We're going to need three more of these. We add up. I think it's going to be more stone and wood. Let's put these down before I go falling again. What happened there? Oh my gosh. Alright, so we got two of them. Is it out here? Yeah, that's where it is. So we'll do one more and then that'll be, that'll work. That's not too bad. I kind of like that. That's a good little deck. We'll put our... We'll pipe our water up kind of under there. And then we'll be able to set up our cooker. Set out some preserving bins. Maybe some chairs. A little bit of torches. It'll be fantastic. I think it was just one of those we were missing. Dude, I'll tell you what, you and your tail, let's just, let's solve the issue right now. No, we're not going to run you off. That's not how we solve the issue. <laughs> Turn them around the other way. I should finish this up up here. So see, here's a weird thing. How come this side... It's even. What happened here? Oh, it's because this, this side goes out further. I forgot because of that. So it's trying to clip to... Okay, yeah. That's what it is. All right. Alright, so there's that. That's not too bad. What do you guys think? Pretty decent deck for putting the grill and everything out here? Cooking? Fire pit? All that good stuff? Let's see if I can get this thing to clip. Maybe we should do another triangle. A little more wood. I'm out of wood altogether, I think. We'll check the horse, see if he has some. He does just enough for one. Um, I'm gonna have to build some more stairs to get in until I get this sorted out. All right, let's try to get this to clip the proper direction, which I can't see because yeah, there we go. So what I want to do is get one to clip just right, so then I can put another regular ceiling there. I don't think it's gonna work like that though. Yeah, that's still going to clip through. That's kind of where that one is. Hmm. I don't know. That's one little area I'm going to have to mess with later. Can I pick up? I can. I can put one there, but it's going to be the same thing. That would work, but it's going to be the wrong angle. <gasps> oh, dude, I didn't want to jump off here. Oh, man, I was wanting to jump off onto the... Yep, well, we didn't die. <laughs> I was wanting to jump off onto the grass there. Well, we got our bird with us. Can I borrow your wings, please, good sir? Oh, uh, we're overweight. Well, construction mistakes have been made. <laughs> I didn't mean to jump off the edge, man. I knew it was going to happen. That's why I was putting the railings up. 
I'm gonna take a quick look underneath to see if I can get it fixed. And then if anything, if I can't, I will put like a bench there or maybe a preserving bin. It's kind of out of the way. And I almost did the same thing and jumped off there again. Well, I tell you what. Alright, so we needed to go to right there. Yeah, see, the only place I could put it is right here. And that's still not going to give me the angle that I need. Neither is that. Yeah, I'm going to have to figure out something else. Alright, cool. Let's leave that like it is. We are kind of done here for the moment. I need to get a lot more resources. And sit and think about that a lot. Let's go ahead. We're going to take the horse and the Argentavis. We'll go down and grab some crystal. Oh, that's always a possibility, Evan, playing with other people. I haven't even thought about it. I'm so early in my YouTube stage. I just haven't worried about trying to do anything with any other players right now or any other content creators. I mean, it's always an option, though, right? Let's get rid of this stuff. So we don't need that or those. We will eat them. We don't need that or that. That's our Feather Raptor. We'll definitely need him. Dude, the fog is rolling in like crazy. Cool, let's take a trip down to the Aberration area and possibly, but try not to die. Let's just grab all that, we'll leave it all in him. And we got a bowl on us in case we need it. Let's grab the horse. Ah, the rain. It's always nice. Dude, that's so much junk. Ah, oh, I need to build some more stairs over here until we get the rest of this place built. So we also need to come back and get a forge going and get a smithy set up over here. Oh man, we're full already. Um, We're leaving you here. So hold on to that stuff. You'll be alright. Don't worry about the weight. You'll be fine. Let's grab this dude. And I can't remember, is it hot or is it cold down in the aberration area? I think it's hot down there, right? Let's put this into... Wait for sure. Nice, nice. Well, it's, it's coming along. It's taking a little bit to get it built, but once we get the crystal and stuff, it'll go a lot faster whenever we get kind of like the foundation and all that down. Main thing is crystal. Oh, dude, we're going to need so much of it from down there. I mean, we could get it from over here. Ah, let's go take a trip down below. It's been a while since I've been down to the aberration zone. It's going to be quite the flight, though, is the only thing. So what I plan on doing is we'll get the industrial forge made eventually one of these days. We'll put it inside. Our walls will be high enough to fully enclose that and a tech replicator whenever we get to there. So I think we need to go at least six or seven walls high. And then the inside will kind of be two stories in there. We'll kind of section part of it off. We'll have a huge area up there for making all of our jerky. And then we'll have like our, our storage up there too for some other stuff. Maybe some flyers. And then the top will be... Kind of like for the wyverns and stuff, whenever we get that done. We'll also need to make a little egg hatching hut. It's kind of nice since they got those egg hatching stations now. The egg hatchery, or whatever it's called. Dude, it makes it so much easier, so you don't need all those air conditioners for that. Let's stop and get some stamina up here. We are going the right way, aren't we? We are. I know there's more than one entrance, but this is the only one that I know of for sure and know how to get around. I think the other one has a weird radius where you can't fly around it. Stop right here, get some stamina. Last thing I want to do is have to stop down there and get knocked off by a Microraptor, then ate by a Rex.
Why is it to the right or to the left? I think it's over this way, isn't it? Yeah, we need to go down this way a little bit more. Should be right on the other side of the shore there. Will be the little cave to go down in. We'll try to grab as much crystal as we can to fill the Argentavis up, and that should be fine just for getting the walls made. Or at least the front front glass walls. That's all good, man. We're still here. I know how you feel, and I haven't ate yet either. Usually eat before stream, but <laughs> got a little busy. I was trying to get some stuff done in here before we started. I was trying to get enough wood and stuff going so we could build some like we did. I don't want to have to farm too much while we're doing our live streams. I'd like to spend that time kind of building stuff. But we are right over here by the cave, finally. I was thinking about doing some mining down in here for the metal too, but I mean, there's so much of it on the mountains up here. And since we can't take the bird in, Kind of, kind of makes it harder. Hey, Fabled, how's it going? All right, let's leave him here. Let's get our horse out. Put him back into here. So for the people just joining in on the stream, we're working on building right now our base, but we're kind of at a point where we need to get some glass and stuff and a lot more resources. So we're going to head down here to the Aberration area, since there's tons of crystal, grab some of it, and then we'll be using that for making our, part of our huge glass walls on the front of the base. At least that's a plan, as long as no deaths happen, which it's always an option. Turn our lights up so we can see a little bit better. Give you a, a shout out, kind of like how I said, "Hey, how you doing?" When you came in, <laughs> ah, it's always good to see you here, man. I don't think there's any crystal up here. I think we need to go down here. There should be some of the green crystal nodes. Just as we get down in further, but we do gotta watch out for the ravagers. Oh, dude, we gotta watch out for the ravagers. There's that weird lag, so we are down in the caves now. Does anybody know if the hallucinogenic mushrooms down here give you biotoxin? I can't remember if they have that on this map or not. It's usually easier to get them that way. Oh, there's, there's ravagers. Yep, there's definitely ravagers. We'll probably see some whenever we get down here a little bit further. Yeah, I'm worried about the raptors too. We've had so many runs run-ins with raptors, but the horse is pretty good for... Scaring them away with his kicks because of the torpor. Nah, I don't I don't do anything with the mods, so all the ravagers are just standard. I think whenever Valgaro first came out, they removed it and then put them back in. Oh, there's no biotoxin. Ah oh, man, so we will have to do jellyfish hunting for that. I mean the good news is we won't have to worry about running over the patches of mushrooms and getting sick, you know. Yeah, there's some crystal there. Nice. We'll probably trash all the green ones. We're just here for the regular crystal. For right now, at least. This cave, it just kind of leads down to this area. It goes down a little bit further. There's an artifact that we need to get, but it's down in the radiation zone. We will be going down there. The thing is, you have to go down in there to get the stuff to make a hazmat suit. Nah, no reapers on this map. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're correct. I think it was supposed to have rock drakes, but they removed them. It was supposed to have the griffins, too, but they also removed those. You can get all that in a mod pack now from the dude that made the map. Same with Crystal Isles, they removed so much stuff that was supposed to be on it, but the uh, the map developer before Wildcard took over 
made a mod to put everything back in. Yeah, I think they did. For some reason, they kind of kept it separate. They didn't want people, since Valguero's a free mod, they didn't want people getting this map and then getting everything that the paid DLCs have into it, which, I mean, I kind of understand that. But at the same time, it's like there was so much more supposed to have been on this map, you know? Especially Crystal Isles. That was supposed to have everything on it, and then so much got ripped out, and then they didn't patch it. So everything that they took out... There was, like, empty holes where there was no mobs spawning and stuff. No teams, no dinos, nothing. Alright, so we're doing fairly decent. Dude's always complaining about being hungry. We're almost gonna be out of water here soon before too long. We might keep some of the stone on the way out, depending on how much crystal we get. I'm not going to be doing too much crystal farming right now. But there is a ton of it, at least. And I don't remember where you get the blue crystals on this map. I think the blue ones you get from... I don't think they have the little nodes down here for it, like this. We'll have to get a gas collector made before too long, too, to sit down here and let it start collecting gas. Alright, so those are all gone. Drop those. We'll keep some before we leave. Actually, let's get rid of that stone. We're getting more crystal than I thought. We'll get one full horse full of crystal, and that'll be good for today on that. I think there's some more up here. Tons of metal down here. I was thinking about putting a little outpost down here and just use it for smelting. Bring the Anki down, have him do harvesting, and maybe put it right over there. That's kind of where I usually put my little base at. My little outpost when I'm down here. Surprised we haven't seen any creatures. There's usually quite a few in the walkway down here. They'll probably be all spawned in on the way out. How did the horse jump so long? Uh, was it when we were coming down the ramp? That might have been what it was. Yeah, before we start doing the jellyfish harvesting, we'll probably go down into the underwater cave in the tunnel and grab us a, one of the whales. It's like the best bet for grabbing the jellies without dying. And so far, we've had some issues with dying. <laughs> like to avoid that if we can. Alright, I think we're good on crystal. Let's take a look and see. 2-4, almost 500. That'll be fine for now. That'll get us a couple windows started, because they're how much for each one? Oh, that's right, I need to look in here. Ah, they're 25 for each one. Hmm. It'll be fine. I'll grab some more off camera. When we're not recording, I'll try to get some more harvested up. Do a couple runs down here. But let's head back up towards the top. Throw out the bird. Transfer everything over. Maybe we'll grab some metal on the way back, and then as soon as we get back to base, we'll have to build a forge. Start getting the metal ready, and get a smithy set up so we can start making some of the windows. I mean, we could always use the one at the other base, but I don't want to have to keep flying back and forth, you know? It's kind of weird how there's nothing down here. I know it takes a while to spawn in sometimes. Yeah, should have been some rock drakes for sure. Especially on Crystal Isles, man. That whole one side of the map was supposed to be rock drakes. 
where like the floating aisles are. Would have been nice to have them. Plus, you figure on this map with the chalk hills being so high, dude, it'd be awesome for gliding with the rock drakes from one side to the other when you're trying to get around the map. And then for also being down in the Wyvern Trench. Yeah, that Wyvern Trench is no joke, man. Oh, dude. There's two ways in on that, right? One by the snow, then it leads out the other side? I can't remember. It's been so long. It's been about two years since I've been on this map. No creatures. I should have come down in here to get them to spawn in. Or start spawning in. Yeah, what you got? Yep, just leaving the aberrant zone. We went down there, got us quite a bit of crystal. Got almost five stacks. That'll get us started, and then I'll farm some more up whenever we get done recording. Before the next stream, I'll get some more ready, and we should at least be able to get some of the stuff ready today before we go for the glass windows. I need to set up a forge and smithy as soon as we get back up here to base. There we go. Hate that little bit of lag when you're leaving out. Yep, I've done dino transfers back before my YouTube days. I learned real quick that you can crash the game if you transfer them too quick whenever you're taking them out. But other than that, I normally start fresh every time I go to a map. I mean, I keep my character and all of his levels, but I don't bring anything with me. No tames, no weapons or blueprints or anything. Kind of keeps it a little interesting, you know, whenever you have to start over kind of fresh. Dude, would you just get on them and stop? Why can I not? Oh, we're too close. I hear you back there. The The bad part is I can't get on my bird. We're too close to the aberration zone. Oh, come on, dude. Well, that almost got spicy real quick. <laughs> I couldn't get on them. We got the raptor over there. We got the rex. Fabled, what was your suggestion? All I see is if you don't have one. Oh man, doing anything with mods is interesting. That's why I was doing all my playthroughs my first whole run through without doing any mods because I had a problem back before YouTube where I was playing and I was on Aberration and came back and everything was gone. All my S plus stuff was just totally wiped. So my whole base and everything, I took about a year off of, U of, of uh, Arc after that. Totally wiped everything. It was just an issue with the mod. But that's why I'm not wanting to mix modded and unmodded playthroughs. I had just too much, too much problems. Let's land up here, get some stamina. Now all we gotta do is fly across the river, and we are back at our new base. Well, 
the start of our base. We'll probably go ahead and get, like I said, the forge and smithy set up. And then probably, I'll try to get some metal. We'll see about getting some metal and then making a couple windows. And then we'll probably end this stream. So we still got a little bit left, but we've been going for quite a while now. What's up, Fabled? I don't know if your messages aren't coming through or what. Ah, back at base. Well, at least we didn't die. Oh, dude, there's a raptor, though. That's all right. That's not my dodic, is it? Nah, it's not. Man, we got to get some some turrets or something up up here to protect stuff if I'm going to keep leaving it like that. All right, so let's put that into weight. Let's see, what do we need for a forge? Probably going to be out of wood, right? I think that's the main thing we were missing. Yep, let's grab some wood. Forgot you were still on follow. We'll grab it from the trees over here. It'll be fine. We don't need too much. I need to get rid of these trees anyways. Oh, don't fall off. Dude, that was really close to the edge. How much we got? Almost two stacks, that should be fine. We'll take out these two, and that'll be enough for making the two things. Um, I'm not seeing many. It could be an issue on my end, or maybe your end. All I keep seeing is you say, if you don't have one. I've seen that message three times, and then question marks, and that's it. Alright, we'll grab some of that, and that's... Flint hide and a little bit of fiber. Do we not have flint? There we go. A little bit. Not enough though, right? Yep, it's good. And then... Get one of those going. And we'll put this right here. Just for now. That's probably a temporary location. Put a whole stack in there. See if we can find us some metal real quick. Oh, it's full already, isn't it? Man. That's alright, we'll hold on to the hide. Alright, so, metal for this area. I know there's some down in the... trenches. There's also the feather raptors down there. That's alright, we'll head over there. It's not too far, just right up here. As long as we don't have any problems with the aloes or the feather raptors, we'll be okay. Yeah, there's some right there, I think. Whole bunch of it. We good? Think so. Might get some wood while we're here, too. Alright, give that to you. Get a little bit more. We'll run back, throw it in there. Get it smelting up. I don't think we need too much metal for each piece of glass, right? That means seven. That's not too bad. That'd be fine. Dude, that's a Rex. He's got to be up there. All I hear is the footsteps. Where is he? Are you down here? Oh, he is. It's another egg, though. 
level are you? 55, that ain't too bad. Hmm. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, nope. Nope, I thought they weren't there. I was gonna grab those other eggs. That's alright, we'll leave it. <laughs> We're here for metal anyways. Hey, how's it going, Similar? Glad you can make the stream. We don't have too much longer left. We got a few minutes still, though. Been doing some building on the base today. We got us an Argentavis tamed up. Built a little trap for him. Went down into the aberration area to get some crystal. And we're heading up now to build... Well, we got the forge built. We need to smelt up some metal. And then build a smithy so we can start working on some glass for the front of the base. You can kind of see it from here, though. It's we're, we're getting there. The foundation's getting built. It's fairly large, and we got a lot more to build on it. Kind of got a little deck out here for putting our industrial cooker and stuff like that. Our grills, preserving bins, and then this is all we got of the foundation for the base. It'll be a little bit further that way, and then we'll extend it out over this way, too. But for now, let's grab that. We're too heavy, of course we are. Alright, cool. At least we got that smelting up. So, we have a little bit more to build with while that's going. Thinking about coming over this way. Maybe over on this side is where we'll put the forge at. We'll build just a little area out for it. Kind of separate. I think I have some pillars and ceilings in here, right? Got pillars, almost out of ceilings. Let's make, well, let's just make all four of these. What are we going to be missing? Everything. Stone, going to be out of thatch, which we have. Some wood. Should have some stone in the dodic. Ah, oh, nice. Okay, what map are you on now? I keep forgetting what map you said you were on. But yeah, getting a teared on some raptors, dude. There's something like a little raptor pack. Good little watchdogs, you know. Okay, well, let's break this. That way we can clip to this properly. We get the same height. I think that'll be out far enough. Yeah, that'll be good. And then do we want to bring it out here too? We might as well come out one more on this side. Oh, that's right. You're on the island. Yeah, yeah. The island's good, man. It's it's a lot harder, I'm thinking, than some of the other maps I've been on. At least the boss fights are, kind of. Maybe because I got destroyed on the Alpha Ape a couple times? I don't know. <laughs> it's been, a, it's been a, a journey. Let's just say that. So I'll we'll put that one back there. So I think three wide will fit the, the forge right back there. So let's make up some more of the ceilings. Five, that's not going to be enough. What are we missing? Oh, we're going to be out of thatch and wood. Dude, I like the beavers, man. They're good for wood harvesting. So we're going to need one, two, three, four, five, six more if we can find some stuff. I think we're out of everything. So we need to get some more wood and some more thatch. All right, let's head over again. Grab some more stuff. We're still waiting for that stuff to smelt up anyways for that metal. Yeah, the beavers are good though, man. They're fast too. They're good little mounts for kind of doing land and water. And then if you're harvesting wood and still building up with it. On the island, I started doing... Well, I mean, my whole base is pretty much wood. I tried to do it a little bit different because I always do stone or something. And that's one of the things I was going to tame at first, but... I ended up getting a mammoth instead for the wood.
Yeah, just put all of his points into, like, carry weight and stuff. Allow you to carry a lot more, you know? So they get, uh, I think it's, it's either 50 or 75% reduction on the weight. What, right over here? Is where you spawned at? Because if you spawn up here, that's horrible, because it's like... <laughs> it's like a little island up here. Almost out of water. Oh man, that's horrible. Yeah, it's really bad timing, and there's nothing but those uh, feather raptors down below us. Yeah, no kidding. It's it's definitely safe until you got to go get something to to eat or drink. <laughs> it's a rough time then. Uh, where's my bird at? I think it's over here. Speaking of water, I know there's some below us, but it's kind of a bad area. Yep, there he goes crying. Ah, oh, dude. All right, let's put you on passive so you don't run if I get attacked. Try to get some water down here. Oh, I thought there was a little river down here. Guess not, huh? Hmm. Well. Top side we go. Yeah, that should be plenty. I didn't use too much for that level 145. That I just tamed. That was an Argentavis, so. Are we good? No aloes. See, we should have enough of our metal made so that we can make our smithy real quick. Ah, okay, yeah, yeah. The island. Alright, give me all this. And actually, I'm gonna need to hide two. Uh, let's get rid of this wood first. Give me a little bit of stone, dude. Make up some more ceilings. Eleven, that'll be plenty. That'll finish up right over here. That's the one thing I wish you could change in the settings for single player is the craft speed. Instant craft would be fantastic. Nice, it's not bad. So I think what we'll do is... We might play with some of the triangles to kind of make this where it's not quite so boxed off. We'll have to see. We'll do that later. And then that side's done. And this side will probably come out... Maybe like right here. And that'll square off the base. That'll be big enough for the inside of our base, I think. A good start on it, at least. What are we missing for the uh, smithy? We got the forge already. Some metal and a little bit more stone. Ah, nice. So not, not much left after he's knocked out. Feed him some berries. Protect him. Good to go. Make him a saddle. Usually the, uh, knocking them out part's the worst, but, and I was having problems with the, the keeping him alive while he was taming up yesterday. Let's set this just right over here for now, too. Like I said, it'll probably all move later. Yeah, what's up, Fabled? Uh, the Mammoth is a better if you have both of them. I would definitely get the Mammoth. It'll protect you better. And, um, the wood's better on them. Yeah, I would build some spikes to put around him while he's taming. Kind of keep him safe, you know? Wooden spikes should be fine. Alright, give me all this crystal. Uh, 
Wait, where's the other one at? There we go. I'm not seeing anything about deleted messages. The only thing that Nightbot is set up to delete is if there's anything with links in it. Other than that, I don't know. I'm not seeing anything because normally it'll still show me if a message is deleted. It'll still show it to me, but I'm not even seeing it. Yeah, they look better too with the Mammoth TLC. Yeah, for sure. Alright, so let's see. What are we missing for our greenhouse? Paste. We have a ton of that over here. Well, not a ton. We got some. Alright, so we need the flat windows. All three. <laughs> I think we just need some more metal. We'll be able to make some more. Oh, man, it's gonna look nice. Oh, dude, we're gonna need a ton of it, but it'll look good. I don't know if we can clip some of the... No, because it's on a corner. That's one thing else about S Plus I like, is you can put these in a the corner and make it kind of like a... a column that goes up. Yeah, as long as there's no Dillos around, you should be alright. Dude, I was having so many problems with Dillos, killing myself off yesterday. Alright, that's melting. Let's make a couple more walls. You're empty. And you're empty. Make all six of those. We'll put these stairs out over here. For the moment, so that I can actually get up and down without problems. Yeah, I'm not sure, Fabled. It's... Something's blocking your messages or something. I'm not seeing hardly anything you're saying. I don't know what's up with it. I will just put these here for now. One. Boy, I tell you what, it's gonna take a while to get that smelted up, I think. Well, I have a lot of grinding to, uh, ooh, hard word sometimes. A lot of grinding to do in between this video and next video. I need to, I need to get a lot more of the metal smelted up so we can make some more of the glass. I need to go farm up some crystal. And then I think what we're gonna end up doing is, like I said, we'll put, right over here, we'll put the, the forge when we get one, the industrial. And I'll probably make a way to get in over here with the big dino gateway. That way I can bring in the Argentavis and Anki and stuff like that. And I'm not too sure. Maybe we'll go a little bit further over this way. I'm kind of thinking about building it big enough to where we can keep our main dinos indoors here. And keep them out since there's so many raptors and stuff that spawn in. But we'll have to see how it is. What time is it in my country? Right now it is currently 8.45 p.m. I'm on the west coast in the U.S. But, our base is coming along. Not too bad of a day. We got the Argentavis. We got the Argentavis trap. We can use again later. In my latest video. Okay, I'll take a look at the comment section. I'll take a look whenever we get done streaming here. I'm just getting ready to end too. So I'll take a look then. And then we got the base going. So we'll see. We'll get some more building done in the next one. And then look at getting some more teams going too. But, we are going to go ahead and leave this one here. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.